I want you to take a close look at this bug. Okay. This is what's known as a spotted lantern fly. It might look cool and colorful, but actually it is bad news. The invasive bug has taken over parts of New Jersey and experts are doing whatever they can to contain it so it doesn't destroy more plants and trees, but they need your help. Eyewitness News reporter Nina Pineda has the details. Grab you can try grabbing. No. Attempt stomping, yeah, but the spotted lantern fly moves like lightning. Ah, ah, ah. They're not aggressive. They kind of look like pretty cockroaches. They're very colorful. They're pretty, but they're flies and they're dangerous to our trees and our plants. Janice Keegan and the staff at this Warren Nursery are following the rules now that Somerset's been added to the New Jersey eight county quarantine zone to try to contain the invasive bug. They're shaking down trees and inspecting all products that come into the Truesdale Nursery to avoid an infestation. The State Department of Agriculture is encouraging citizens to go on search and destroy missions. If you see a spotted lanternfly like this one here, you are supposed to kill it. But they're quick. They jump. Yeah. See? They jump. Got it. It's important to destroy the lanternfly whenever you see it because it's an invasive insect that is not native to the United States. Rutgers entomology professor George Hamilton was out looking for the elusive bug today. He feels even more counties should be added to the quarantine list. Wherever it is established, it has created some environmental and also agricultural issues. The rules to contain the species ask that you don't move wooden products like debris, bark, yard waste, firewood, construction waste, and also inspect outdoor household articles like recreational vehicles, lawn tractors, mowers, grills, outdoor furniture, tile, stone, and fire pits. When you're transporting materials like this from place to place, you're supposed to look before you leave. In Somerset County, Nina Pineda, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.